Now, as I watched him in that drone footage, injured, barely able to move, I couldn't help but wonder, what was he thinking? Like, what was going through his mind at that particular moment? Did he see that drone coming at him and did he think, I did great? Did he feel proud of the death toll? Tens of thousands of his own people that he caused? Did he think, yeah, I'm, I'm sitting here, I'm about to be killed in this completely destroyed living room among the ruins of other homes in Gaza? Did he say, yeah, yeah, good on me? Was it that or did he recognize the undeniable truth of his failure? After everything he's done, some people are trying to hail him as a hero, but we know the truth, we saw it with our own eyes. He lost, and he lost really badly. He was also, we know now, was among the six hostages. Hirsch, Kalmel, Alex, Eden, Oruvel, who were brutally executed as the IDF was closing in on him. In his final moments, did he realize he was about to become another footnote in history? Joining the ranks of those who tried and failed to kill the Jewish people in the past?